on guys politics gaming here and today i'm doing the fifth episode of the islamic republic of iran so basically today we are going to continue our um dash for democracy while also keeping our um military and um social policies intact so let's go ahead and purchase some Let's go for 50 helicopters. We're going to increase our military strength. That will be $707 million. We can go for that. Let's go for... Um, you know what? We're going to go after um, producing our own weapons. Um, frigates. We can get some rank 2 frigates. Let's go for 10. Okay, you know what? Three. Okay, let's go for two. And then let's go for one time payments. Five billion dollars. Okay, four point eight billion dollars. Then let's increase this to 550,000. Well, we have 46 land bases. Um, program to develop nuclear weapons, Ur uranium enrichment in progress, 336 days. Um, I think we're going to continue our nuclear program because it is going to be essential to our to the defense of our nation. Um, so let's go over here. Let's go to road transport. Let's go to rail and road maintenance as well as air. It's going to be about two billion dollars. Um, let's go here to industry and let's go to building housing and roadway. We are actually producing our own. Let's go to new contract. Let's go to that. Building housing and roadway. We are actually producing our own. Nice. Um, looks like those tariffs actually did wonders for it. Um, whoa. Let's go to custom duties. Let's increase that to 10%. Um, we are not taxing them. Chemical industry. Let's put some custom duties on there. Let's do another 10%. Um, so we have that. Um, let's actually go after a tax reform. Let's just go ahead and call it a plain and simple tax reform. Let's do that. Increase this to 4%. Let's increase this to 41%. Um, company turnover. Let's do it to 2.5. Five. No, that's not going to work. Let's do it for 2%. Tax on redundancies, petroleum. <clears throat> Hydrocarbons, meaning for house, for heating. You know what? Let's actually reduce our... Um, tax. Okay, so we can actually do it to one point one two five. Let's just give it a flat point one. And then let's go over here. Let's go to tax on financial transactions. Point 
0.15. And then let's do that. And then let's go ahead and skip to the area in which it gets passed. Let's go ahead and attend this holiday. Environment. Um, wow, two wildfires in North America. One in Canada, and then there's one in the United States. Oh, wow, there's one in Russia. Uh oh. Oh, there is a heat wave in um, Egypt. Minister of Labor threatens our course of action. When is that going? 50.54, wow. 8.30, 2018. Tuvalu. 520 dead in Tuvalu. And let's go ahead and skip to 8.30, August 30th. Religious holiday appearance by the president. Um, and I also got a reply back from um, you guys. So I am actually going to keep the presidential system um, in Iran. But um, I am going to change a couple of its electoral laws um, before I start pushing for an actual democracy. Um, in which... Wow. Unrest. Growth simulation is incompatible with the increase in the contributions the companies have to pay, Mr. President. Many restless investors are contacting me with regard to the topic to know if the situation will persist or improve. For the moment, I have not answered. Growth simulation is incompatible with the increase... And contributions companies have to pay. Increased company contributions. Survey report. Disapproval among wealthy people, Mr. President. According to Mo this is because of the increase in the wealth tax. You are giving A swing to the right in agreement with. I must remind you that the goal of political organization like ours should be to alleviate as much as possible to contribute contributions paid by businesses. Tax reform has passed. Um, we can go ahead and reduce overall um, contributions made by um, businesses. And um, we can basically push for um, the re reduction of the payroll tax. We can get the employee to go down to 15% where we can probably get the employer to pay um, around maybe 30, 35%, maybe 37% would be the first goal. <clears throat> um, public debt is $102 billion. Let's go over here. Let's go to train. You know what? Let's go to Turkey. Let's go to transportation. So go to authorization, and then let's go to Azerbaijan, and let's ask the same thing. Let's ask for the authorization to build a railroad. Let's go about two days. Azerbaijan and Turkey agree to the potential partnership. All right, so let's go over here. High-speed train. Space Control Center is on top of the game. I'm going to look at that in a second. I have never seen that one before. Let's build a railroad from Tabriz. Wait. Building on the knowledge of controlling satellites and space probes, and after having developed our capacities and recruited expert engineers, we are now in position to utilize a space station or a permanent planetary base. Such a base will be indispensable for communication and assure the safety of our astronauts on a daily basis. We are not the first, but we can profit a lot from this technology. Oh. Um, 
no, we're not going to patent it. I can push for um, a space station. It can actually be a Middle Eastern space station. I can actually do that. Let's actually go ahead and form that right now. Um, where is it? Space research. Let's go to space research. Let's go to Earth. Let's go here. The aim of the station will be to replace the ISS whose future remains uncertain beyond 2024. The interest in such a station is both strategic and scientific. Furthermore, it will be staging platform or re refuge for crews waiting to depart of returning from other missions. Such a station is made by assembling at least three habitation modules. Uh, yeah, we can definitely push for a space station. Um, space telescope. Living in space. We're going to go ahead and give our boys in the space habitation module more funding. Let's go here. Let's go here. Space space propulsion. Return to Earth. Um, we can just give all of them all full funding stars. Relaunch. Landing. Supporting human life. Astronaut. Yeah, let's get astronaut training, supporting human life in space. How much would it be if we were to give it all full funding? Wow, only $219 million. And then let's add 50000 to our research. We're definitely not going to make it to Mars. We're definitely not going to make it to the moon. So there's no reason racing Russia and the United States to that. Um, but we would definitely be able to um, compete in space um, in our closest neighbors, especially the moon, and um, even um, to build a new space station. We can actually build a Middle Eastern space station. We can partner with India, Turkey. Um, let's actually send an envoy to create a military alliance. Let's do a non-aggression pact between our nations. Has refused. Um, Turkey has abandoned the, the project. Difficult financial situation. <clears throat> Let's build um, a train between Arabil and Baku. We definitely have to fund this entire project. Let's do it in 10 months. And then, since we are going to be opening ourselves up to the world, let's go ahead and push for an intense traffic airport. <clears throat> Where can we build it? Um, I think Tehran would have to be um, a prime thing for that because everyone would be flying into Tehran and then we can build like two smaller airports in other parts of the country. Okay. Let's invest $2 billion into this airport. It'll be done in seven months. Let's do it south. You know here transport of goods we will undoubtedly see a small improvement but nothing major and then let's go down to the southern part I'm gonna build a medium traffic airport in Bandar Abbas Okay, actually, instead of Bandar Abbas, I can do it in uh, Kuzestan. Shh. 
Gotcha. Transport network sufficiently equipped. All right. Inauguration of a university campus. Work begins. We'll see a small improvement for transport of goods, but nothing major. All right. So I guess these were slightly good investments. Not the best, but slightly good. Inauguration of a multi multidisciplinary center. No, I'm not going to cut the red ribbon. Population. GDP per capita is going up, um, but it is not stable. Let's look at our growth rate. 26. It is going down very, very slowly. If we can get it to slowly go down, um, we will definitely be able to um, stabilize our economy. Um, and then I think I'm going to go ahead and make one big decision for this. Um, hmm. So, rules and commandments of the official religion incorporated into the Constitution. I want to move out of that. Um, I think executive powder... Power would be subject to the approval by religious authorities, or we could just move to um, influence of the official religion and state functioning. Um, let's go to unions, right to strike. Let's go ahead and make a move to limit and monitor the right to strike. Let's actually put this to a referendum. While wow, 93, overwhelmingly, it will be passed. Uh-oh. Declare a day of strike across the country. Wow, I give you guys rights, and the first thing you guys want to do... Well, I mean, yeah, you know, they're going to demonstrate that right. Um... This will damage our economy. It's a striking example. With those in power, high density in the labs. US is really flexing its muscles in space. All right, let's go to the strike. Uganda wanted to meet. Let's get rid of these. Day of action. Government is industrial policy is forced the national conventional conventional gas union to declare to create a day of action. So I could cancel the bill. Five thousand seven hundred. 5,600. Well. Ambient success. Ambient success. Although our, although our action day did not... Alright, I think we can leave it as a restricted and monitored. Um, associations... We can leave it as dependent from the state. Iraq, wow, 1.6 million uh, um, Afghans. Let's go to media. Freedom of information. Um, information controlled and censored. We can move that up, but I mean, that would really damage our regime. Justice, propose a law to ban the death penalty, control measures for judges, high courts appointed by the state. Let's go here. Still a religious regime, um, law and the right to strike. Turnout was average. All right, it looks like everyone has the right to strike. Let's go here. 
no family. Um, currency, let's look at that. 26%. Ugh, inflation is getting out of control. We're going to have to cut some contracts soon. Growth is slowly starting to go down. 26% to 26%. Um... Inflation is uh, terrifying right now. Um, we're going to have to start lowering inflation. 6.45 billion dollar cash surplus. Let's go ahead and see how much of our debt was just paid off. About 6 billion dollars. Um, in 2018, in the beginning we had 67 billion. Now we have uh, 90 95 billion, so that is weird. Let's go to immigration. Let's see what our immigrant. We have no illegals. Wow. Let's go to Secret Service. Go. Let's go to terrorists. Let's put him under surveillance. Made inquiries on where to get a get a van. And then let's look into you guys. Let's put all of you guys under surveillance. Sign up for a contact sport. Join the forum on a bomb making website. Turkey Ultra Conservative the Coalition. Says if U1 doesn't like E2 and E2 doesn't like E3, then E1 and E3 could be friends. Um, yeah, we can meet with them. What is our relation with Turkey? 68 to 73. Let's go ahead and give the paper a read. Law on the right to strike, referendum approved with 53% turnout. Restriction on the right to strike, this law originates from the abuses of strikers. The Minister of Labor defended... New legislation right to strike must be used only when all negotiations fail and not as a means of pressure or basic method of exchange. This law will give the right to strike this two raisin and prevent all too frequent deviations we see in the working world that end up affecting the economy. I actually agree with that. I actually very, very much agree with that. Thumbnail. Um... Well, all the news, um, all the news is about the new strike. In Zahiden, workers attempted to come out on strike in vain. It was no good because their demands were illegal under the new law. 28 workers were forced to stop their strike, which had lasted 21 days because it was against the new law, which had since been passed. Wow, I've never seen these before. The rebels retreat... So a lot of the strike was actually hindered um, because a lot of the a lot of it um, was illegal under our new law. Um, let's give more funding to helping young people find work, and then let's give help to seniors to find work. Let's give our employment agency more funding. See, why can't it be like that? Why can't it be like that? Um, unemployment rate. Stable around 4%. Was that state employees? Yeah, there was state employees. This is the Tabriz Agreement. 
Let's go ahead and suppress the contract so we can start controlling our growth. We can sell gas elsewhere. Government waste. Speaking of the Ministry of Energy, let's go to Energy. Go here. Good. On shore, let's get this up to five. Four then five. Let's go to service. Trade balance is going up. That is good. Let's go to energy. Let's go to oil. Let's see what our oil has been looking like. Um, oil well, well four. What about gas? Well, we are extracting a lot of gas. I don't even think. Yeah. Let's see how much more gas we can actually dig up. Very good. Let's build one near Iraq. You know what, let's build another oil well. And then let's build oil platform. Research, let's go ahead and give them re um, Research more funding. Let's go here, 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 and here. Let's give everything funding. All right, guys, I think that's enough for today. So I think um, I'm going to go ahead and end right here. So if you guys like this episode, go ahead and leave a like. Subscribe to my channel if you are new here, obviously. Um, looks like our growth is actually going down, which is good. Yeah, but, but it's really starting to fuck up our economy. Um, let's go ahead and give them some financial aid. How much would this... Thanks. Your donation will contribute to our struggle to overthrow the powers that be in our country. All right, if you guys like this, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe to my channel if you are new here, and I will see you guys in the next episode of the Islamic Republic of Iran, or shall it become the Republic of Iran? We shall see. Thank you, guys, and take care.